Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Rocky Shostak and we will see today how to create and open files from the Eredis 2014 software for Windows. Happy training with Eredis 2014. The Eredis 2014 homepage opens each time you launch Eredis by clicking on the application icon on the desktop or in the taskbar. During a work session you can return to the home page with the home button or in the file menu. It allows access to all files that Eredis can handle. Eredis genealogies, Eredis tree charts or JetCom files. If you cannot remember where you have saved a file that you have not used for some time, Eredis will help you find it on your hard drive. The home page also allows you to connect to the Eredis Learning Center. Here you can download technical data sheets, a sample file, consult in the Eredis forums, watch training videos and ask questions. Finally, you can customize your home page by posting a picture of your choice, a meaningful place for your genealogy, photo of an important ancestor or an interesting act. Click the display area and select the picture with your Windows Explorer. To start a genealogy and enter your immediate ancestors, click the new family file button. Give your family file a name, for example, Rokoso family. It is recommended that you save the genealogy file to the Eredis, Eredis files folder. But you can change this location by clicking the modify button. Click OK to launch data entry for your genealogy. Eredis displays a list of all the genealogies that you recently used. For each file, the date of the last modification is displayed. Click the name of the genealogy to open it. If you want to open a genealogy that does not appear in the Open Recent Files list, click the Open Tree Eredis File button. All files created with an earlier version of Eredis are accessible. If it is a JetCom file from another genealogy program, click the JetCom file button. Then select the file using Windows Explorer. To open a tree chart created and saved with Eredis, click the chart file button. The tree chart files are located, unless otherwise determined by you, in the Eredis tree charts folder. All these file opening functions are also accessible from Windows Explorer and also during a work session by using the file menu. From the Eredis home page, you can simply change the name of a genealogy file. You change the name of the file your cousin sent you from John Jetcom Import to Rockessel Family by clicking the indented wheel and selecting Rename File. If you open a file that does not interest you, Remove it from the list of recent files with the same indented wheel. You may delete the sample file from your own page by selecting Remove from recent files. This does not delete the file, but it no longer appears on the home page. To transmit one of your genealogy files to a friend or cousin, you may also use the indented wheel. It will tell you where the file is situated on your hard drive. Make sure that you send the entire .hmw folder if you want him or her to display it with their version of Eredis 2014. 
During a work session, you can return to the home page to create or open other genealogy files. But you can also use the file menu or the buttons. You have several ways for opening files. When it's a file you have already used, click the access a row located on the toolbar to the right of the home button to display the list of recently opened files or select open recent from the file menu. You can also use the file open menu. All known Erodis files are accessible whether they have been created with the current version or earlier versions, also JetCom files or tree chart files. To create a new genealogy during a work session, use the file new menu or type the Ctrl plus N keys. Finally, you can open a file directly from the Windows Explorer or the Windows Desktop, even if Eredis has not yet been launched. If the program is already running, drag the .eredis file situated on your genealogy folder and release the mouse button over the Eredis screen. All family files can be opened in this way. If the Eredis program has not yet been launched, drop the file to be opened on the Eredis icon or double-click on the file. The launch of Eredis and opening of the file will take place simultaneously. Thank you for watching this video and see you soon on Eredis.com.